What is up, guys? Back with another video. Today we have another shoe unboxing. These finally came in. Got these ones for Christmas from my mom. Thank you. Here we go. They are from StockX, and you guys should tell what this is already by the box. Man, that's a very shiny old box, not gonna lie. It's like making my eyes bust. And there they are. It is. Why is the flash on? Here's the box. Whole bunch of different crap around it. Why is there foam? right there that makes no sense anyway it is the air zoom tempo next percent off-white men's 15 it's in the infrared colorway so here's the box neon green paper all around i do not know why there is foam right here it's kind of me making me nervous because that's not supposed to be there but we will see so let's open this up so here on the front of the box that's the receipt. Um, it's plain on the inside. Has the light or bright green colorway. Um, that has off white all of it. Sorry, orange. My mom just told me I'm color one. Stop giving me crap. And then here is the shoe. As you can tell, it has the holes right here. That's not covered. Has it right here as well. And then we have the red Nike swoosh right here. That's like scribbled on. We have the air pocket. We have air right here on the heel. We have the like uh, rubber spikes that are all the way down the shoe. And these are not hard. These are very like squishy and everything. Um, on this side, we have the writing that says off white for Nike Air Zoom Tempo Next Percent Beaverton, Oregon, USA. And then these were made in 2021. Here it has the Nike logo that they put on all their shoes. Here is the little like foam thing right here air bubble again which this has a nice nike logo right here and the inside of that air bubble that rubber is a red so yeah uh looking at the top of the shoe we have the tag that says made in vietnam we have the stock x tag and we have the um like well-known off-white zip tie right here and uh what color is this mom like a tan like a tan then we have the red laces right here more of this like material right here it has the shoelaces right here that off-white's known for which my black pair doesn't the air force one highs which i'll show you in a sec well in a different video but it has this little button clip right here for the shoes <coughs> on the, the tag of the sh the tag of the shoe is right there on the side and the this is the insole of the shoe it's a very crazy insole if you can't already tell sorry for that shaking it's a uh, bright orange or green or whatever sole and it has the same design in the back as it does on the wrapping paper but it has the big nike swoosh on this one i think it's the same for both shoes so let me check real quick and see so here we have the second shoe and another thing to mention is right here on this it's on all the shoes if it has a color they have peaks of the other color because they just like layer it on and it's like a little cool thing. And yes, it is on the other shoe as well. So this one obviously doesn't have it. And then I did not know this to be honest. But this pair comes with another pair of laces. It's a white lace with a red uh, lace tip. And this one's a red pair with a white lace tip. And they both have the shoe laces on it obviously. So yeah, let me get these on for you guys and I'll show you what they look like on foot. Put the box out of the way and that. And I did pay, um, two, or my mom paid $262 after shipping and everything for them. So thank you mom for the great Christmas present. These are actually very light, which is surprising because I thought these would be heavy, like the Air Force Ones, the black ones that I also got for Christmas from my grandparents. Because those ones are really, really heavy. I'm just going to stand up and do this. I tried a pair of these on at SneakerCon when I went. But they were a size too small. And I couldn't even get my foot into them. So, yeah, that was kind of a fail. Um, yeah.
Shoes are also very, very tall. So they are gonna make you grow a couple of inches. But from when they, I have them on, I, I didn't unlace them. So they do feel kind of tight. I just loosened them a little, but they feel very, very comfortable. They're very foamy. They are a snug fit. They fit like right to your foot. Feels like a sock. That's because of the material. As you can see through the holes, you can see the color of my sock, which is black. Um, so yeah, everywhere you see black, is just for my foot and shoe. So yeah, that's what that shoe looks like. And then these are very, very comfortable. These are originally running shoes. They were made to fit casual wear. So yeah, big Nike swoosh there on the back. It doesn't come too far up on your ankle. It's pretty low, or not on your ankle, on your Achilles, it's like on your heel. So that's one thing I wish was maybe a little different. Maybe it feels like your foot's gonna be slipping and sliding out, but it's still pretty comfortable. Um, trying to get the second one on. I'm struggling a little bit to get these on, but that's also because I'm not unlacing them. I'm fully like taking them off. Like, so they are gonna be kind of hard to get on right now. I had to unlace this one to get it on though, so it's fine though. I'll obviously make the laces fit more and better. But this is the second one that's on. Obviously, I had to unlace this one. The edges on the shoe. Oh, this one's like a sock liner material. And then this one's just that material. It's like a sock feeling material. As you can see, here's the sock liner material. This is what they both look on on foot. I really like the feel of them. The Nike swoosh comes really high up on the top of your foot. So it's really cool when you're looking down on them. Which I like. Here's the Nike, or here's the inside of the shoes. And here is the outside of that shoe and the outside of this shoe. And I can tell you when I'm walking around, oops, sorry. When I'm walking 